Hello there. Welcome back to today's video. All right, guys. So today I got a very special um, video for you guys, right? So I want to review another project of mine. Uh, it's a very special car. It's another dream car of mine as well. I've been I have been wanting this car for so so long. Um, selling the R34 GDR was probably one of the hardest moments of my life, but it's opened up more doors for more opportunity for me to you know play with all the cars and um, this car is one of them. Right, guys so as you can see this is my new 1991 Honda NSX it's been a dream car of mine for so long so, for, so as you can see cosmetically is is quite um, factory quite standard um, the only mods it's got is callovers and as you can see I got some new T37 SL on it so shout out to Fork and MK Motorsport for getting me these wheels um, shout out to Prestige Tires and Auto for getting me those new Yokohama 8009 so it's automatic but it comes with a full manual conversion kit which in the future i will um, get that installed in the car um, i always wanted a manual nsx but um, they're getting a little bit harder and harder to find nowadays so i, I I'm, I'm happy and settled for an automatic one but the manual conversion is coming so um, that's the that's the end game for this car uh, i want to have a manual conversion um, it's got stock exhaust at the moment, so another mod I want to do is I want to get an um, exhaust system on it. Um, I'm doing a bit of researching at the moment. Uh, I know some titanium exhaust out there is really good um, for the car, so that's it's another another mod that definitely will be will be done. Um, but yeah, like the car itself, it, 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 let's say a lot of people ask me, well, how does it compare to my GDR? Well. Power-wise, is, 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 I can't compare in terms of power-wise because my GDR had 500 kilowatts, right? Um, this thing had probably, I would say, less than half of that. But the thing that what I love about this car is it handles really, really good. And it's just the shape, it's just timeless. And I think the NS NSX was built differently compared to other cars. It's, it's, the, the technology on, on the car or even the tech on it or how it's just amazing how the, the whole car is aluminum so you know literally every panel can be removed like I'm talking about even the rear fenders you can actually unbolt it so every panel on this car can be removed so this that's why it's real lightweight um, it's, it's NA so it's non-turbo but when when I drove it it actually pretty good um, other than that the car is actually pretty low, so as you can see here, that's sort of standard factory height there, and, and the car just sit nice and low. Um, that's what I realized about NSX. It, it just literally look like a supercar. Right, guys so I'm taking the intersect for probably not the first drive but you know I want to take you guys with me as well um, just to see what it what it's like driving the NSX right like like I mentioned before it, it handles really good um, it just got that like I think it's outperformed my GDR that's that's for sure uh, the reason why I keep comparing with my GDR because you know when they came out um, or as you know the in the JDM Legend cars, you got the Supra, GDR, NSX, RX-7. Um, but to me, the NSX just have that presence of a supercar as well. And as you can see, put my foot down, it goes pretty fast for an NA car. Um, 
So, one of my good mate Roy imported his car, I would say two years ago, if I remember correctly, and he just had it in his possession um, for the last two years. Um, after I sold my 34, I sent him a message um, and I offered to buy it off him. And Roy was kind enough to sell it to me. My plan with this car, as you can see, prob probably just cosmetically, mostly. I got the wheels, um, it's already got colovers, so I might just get a nice body kit on it. So let me know um, in the comment what you guys reckon um, for, or what, you, what, what, what mods will you do um, if you're in an NSX, right? Um, there's a lot of body kit out there. I want to probably get something a little bit nicer, uh, but I'm, I'm, I'm not sure which route I'm going to go down yet because I can e either go down for a nice stance look uh, build or I can go like a sort of a time attack build after I put a, a manual conversion because I know the car is capable of actually you know hitting the track and and uh, having some some mad fun with, with, with the car the track. Hey guys, just, I just want to say thank you so much for your recent love, um, your positive feedback. Thank you so much for watching my videos. If you like my video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and you'll leave in the comment below what do you like or what can I improve on my videos, uh, what mods will you put on NSX, and I will see you soon in the next video.